big question we ask today is, can you feed your cows dry maize stovers? Like most questions farmers ask expecting a yes or no answer, it's not always that straightforward. The simple answer is yes. If you offer it to the cows, they will probably eat it and if they don't feed well, you can do what most farmers do and add some molasses. The question shouldn't be whether you can, but if you should. The mistake most farmers make is failing to understand the concept of dry matter and dry matter intake. Dry matter by definition is what remains after water is evaporated, that is, the percentage content in the feed, but not necessarily that the feeds should be dried before being given to the cows. When we teach, we like to use analogies. They are oversimplifications but make concepts easier to understand. Here is one of those examples. Let's say, today you cook ugali for lunch. You eat it when it's hot and fresh, then some remains. You wake up the next morning, it's dry, hardly chewable, and not as appetizing. Between the two, which one will you eat more of and enjoy doing it? Chances are, as you eat your ugali the next morning, there are pieces that are too hard you will pick off and throw. What remains isn't the same as when you cooked. So you will actually eat a smaller piece before you actually get tired of it. Assuming you had to eat the dry ugali daily, how much will you eat and will you really be able to meet your nutritional requirements? Now that we painted your picture, use the same concept to your trough. Does your cow feed well? Does it enjoy its meal? Is there sorting where it picks at its meal and leaves the dry, sometimes dirty and palatable pieces in the trough? If that's the case then, it's clearly not able to get the amount that is required not only to sustain it, but aid in production. There will be an energy deficiency in your herd in this case. Now, those that add molasses and increase intake, the next question now becomes, what is the nutritional value of this fodder plus the molasses? Maize for fodder should be harvested at the dow stage. That's when it's most nutritious. This dry feed of yours was not harvested at dow stage, then dried. It went all the way to maturity and then was left to dry. How does adding molasses improve its nutritional content? Increasing its intake through adding molasses or any other additive makes you what Njogona Patrick calls a manure farmer, who acts as a dairy farmer, as what you are able to add is manure and not milk. And on this, please fight Njogona and not us, yeah? <laughs> By the way, Njogona Patrick is doing a very interesting educative series on his page, dubbed The Journey Continues, where he documents the steps he has taken in a recent consultancy and real-time figures of how things on the farm are changing. You can follow and see that journey. Those that want to be part of the journey and interested in farm performance-based consultancy reach us on 0759-945-708. Anyway, now help us answer this question in the comment section. Mkulima, can and should you feed dry stovers to your dairy cows?